Now, let's say that um, on the rubbish, we want to show a hotspot and say something like, this is rubbish, click here. So, skin. And add an action. Uh, doesn't make sense to open a panorama, but let's say it does. And rubbish, hide it, panoramas, autopilot, on, free, add action, show hide components, rubbish, at end, at end of uh, get arriving at waypoint free, then uh, show rubbish. So now, waypoint three. There it is, and I can say this is rubbish. Click here, and it shows this uh, new panorama. It adds this action, uh, but. Of course, this can be much more. It can be um, showing and hiding components. It can be like playing a voiceover, something, someone talking about um, the, uh, the rubbish that's uh, in there, uh, why it's important to clean it up. Um, and the same you could do like, okay, you know, uh, let's, uh, let's play some voiceover when you're arriving at four and talk about this guy without the helmet. Um, or even play a video, how you can do it better or show a button that says, well, if you want to know what is secure, you know, like a solution, click here. Um, so people can go through the story, they can get relevant buttons, which are uh, relevant at all these little pieces within the panorama, but are hiding as well uh, when you're moving away from them. And this way you can make something very interesting, I think. Um, so basically what we're seeing in this uh, panorama is the settings, uh, these settings, the autoplay settings. There are also within the autopilot, so right over here. Uh, and here is also the repetitions, don't allow interaction and continue uh, path automatically if user doesn't interact for blah, blah, blah. And pause movement if window is open. So for example, if I open a pop-up window at the first one, add action, pop-up web frame, Preview. So now it will show a pop up web frame, which is over here. And there you go. So it loads in my website. I can close it. And when I close it, it starts again. But as I open it, it's pausing. So um, another thing we can do is adding a zoom animation. So I'm going to remove the pop up web frame and uh, zooming in at uh, point one. So all the way to the left, and then at point two, I'm also going to add the zoom animation, but all the way to the right, so zooming out again. And then at uh, point number three, we're going to zoom in again. So zooming in. There we go. Now to point number two, zooming out, as you can see. And now zooming in to point number three again. So there it goes. Ta -ta 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 -ta. So in this way you can uh, work with the, the zoom animation as well. Um, that's it for this tutorial. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like this, this video. I would really like to get one video with 100 likes. So if you, if you made it this far and you don't see 100, please do it. <laughs> so uh, see you.